The defeat of what came to be known as the Great Barbarian Conspiracy pulled the Calradian Empire back from the brink. The time of troubles, triggered by the death of the Emperor, came to an end. The exhausted Imperial factions made peace with each other. While the peoples of the Outer Kingdoms pledge their fealty to the banner of the Double Eagle. Few doubted that the Empire, having come so close to death, would need to change. That the laws that protect property must be strengthened so that the great families of the Empire would better defend it. For some, this new Calradian peace was a time to build. For others, it was a time to trade and to hope the peoples of outer kingdoms would prosper alongside the Empire. Others cautioned that the Empire must remain on its guard, for the ancient jealousies, though put aside for now, would surely surface again. But for now, Calradians rejoiced that their children might enjoy a respite from endless war. And they praised the champion who conquered the barbarians and quelled the usurpers. Who claimed heaven's mandate to reunite the empire by recovering the ancient dragon banner of Calradios. And the citizens of the remade empire would long remember the one who ended the anarchy 